What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode with my pal Alex and Feisty Pants. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Alex's Toy Show. It's Fan Mail Friday for July the 15th. Now, now hold on, player. We got ourselves a lot to talk about this week. Now, first, it's been the All-Star break. I did a whole bunch of shit and coverage this week. Baseball, baseball, baseball. If you guys were watching yesterday, Thursday... When was it? Thursday? Yeah, Thursday. Uh, I put out four. Count them. One. You count them. Four videos. I did the Home Run Derby. I did the uh, the All-Star Game coverage. Uh, I covered the uh, standings and leaders at the break, at the All-Star break. And then I did a, a, a bit on, like, who's going to contend to the postseason. And I called it, you know, buying and selling. Who's buying players? Who's trading for players? Who's buying for their way to get to the postseason? postseason and then who's selling to say hey uh we're not gonna make it but here's some players let's get some youth in return uh check them all out they were all pretty good i thought how about pokemon go everybody's like oh alex are you and feisty pants playing pokemon go hell yeah <laughs> yeah we are you know i might do a pokemon go video uh, I don't know how I'm gonna pull it off because we only have the one phone. See, Grim has like two phones, and he can film himself play in the fu uh, the fucking game. And I just have one phone. I'm gonna have to get another phone, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how I'm doing it. Uh, what else? Uh, but oh, oh, but look, look me up if you guys want to look me up. Or, or I'm not completely sure how it all works. I'm my pal Alex on Pokemon Go. What else would I be? Uh, t-shirt ideas! Paul had some great ideas that I should get into the t-shirt business on ProWrestlingTees.com. I wanted to make the, uh, the Doohop F-U, you effing F shirt that I wear on Doohop's game channel. Um, uh, game show, I meant. But, uh, you know, they're not gonna go for all those curse words, so I can't legitimately put that on there. So I was thinking about other ones, and then I'm like, ah, oh, well, they're... I get it, because, you know, I'm funny. But, you know, the other, the average fan may not understand all the t-shirt jokes that I have. But I got, like, four or five of them written down. So if you think there's something funny, put it in the comments, and I'll see if I can get a t-shirt made out of it. How about that? Now, the big deal, what I'm talking about, the theme, I do a theme. I try to put fan mail and Q&A in a theme every week. You know, This week, I'm talking about the draft. Now, the draft, I'm doing a whole separate ep uh, episode on, on Saturday about the draft. Why, why, what I think about it why it would work, why it won't work. And then the draft itself is this Tuesday on the USA Network. Uh, SmackDown moves to Tuesday and it's live and they're doing the draft. Shane McMahon taking over SmackDown. Now, rumor is, rumor is he's picking Daniel Bryan to be the GM or something like that. Or the, if he's the COO of SmackDown and then there's a GM, I heard it's Daniel Bryan. It's a big rumor that kind of leaked it out. Uh, leaked it out. So, so today's today's fan mail theme is is the draft. Uh, we got a lot of comments front and back, and we got packages. So I'm trying to get all the comments into one video, so the packages can be in the second video. Good luck, right? At Pink Sheep Fan is a big fan of ours. Uh, Grimm's Toy Show, Do Hop, and and myself. For uh, he's 10 years old and been waiting, wanting to talk to us, and now he can because he's got Twitter. Awesome! There's technology working for you. Uh, Makai Awesome is my biggest fan, but Makai did not know the three questions that I asked him to earn a follow on Twitter. And they're easy questions. If you watch my show, then you should you should pick these things out. I'm just saying. Makai, what's up, though? How are you, man? Good try. Valiant effort. Looking forward to hearing more from you. Maybe, maybe in a little while, you get three more questions, and maybe you might know them. At Randy Farb says you should do commentary for the New York Yankees. <laughs> I would love to, but I don't. I don't think I'm as good as Michael K and Paul O'Neill and David Cohn, and um, a Flash. I love Flash. He's the best. All those guys, even on the post and pre-show, they're all great. I I love them all. I I feel I feel Yankee games are so much easier to watch because they're all doing the commentating and the reporting. There's some guys out there that are just fucking boring. I like I can't even stand some people's voices. These guys are pretty great though. Uh, Marjorie at Blue Eyes 39 says, I hope everything is going good for you today. What series are you on? I'm still on series one, looking to complete it. I have a couple of trades pending, so I'm hoping, you know, those cards fill up the whole list. I'll link you the video, and if you got it, hey, and if I get doubles by, by all the trades, then hey, I get, that's more I can trade to somebody else who needs them. 
So check out the video, check out the list. If you have the double, send it to the fan mail with a list of what you're looking for. That would be great. And then we can start on to series two and it'll be awesome. Uh, at Brandon Mercier uh, is a Red Sox fan for life. That's okay because the Yankees-Red Sox rivalry is the greatest rivalry in baseball. And it would not be the greatest rivalry in baseball without the Yankees and it wouldn't be without the Red Sox. So thank you, sir. Uh, Alexander Fusaro has his DF shirt and he's wearing it to WWE Live. Sounds awesome. Uh, you know, get on camera, hold up your shirt. Michael B. Rochester is a Braves fan and he tried to guess my favorite Yankee player last night. That was one of the questions I gave another one of these kids who wanted to earn a follow. And um, the kid had no idea. He, he was like, oh, I'm your biggest fan. And he, he couldn't even, rep he didn't reply for like three hours. I guess he was, he was watching videos trying to figure it out. Uh, we did some videos last week. Drift. Oh, and then in the end, Michael still didn't get it. <laughs> he must have guessed like 50 players. And I'm like, nope, think out of the box. And he's like, something else. And I'm like, come back inside the box. <laughs> valiant effort, Michael. Valiant effort. I had a good time um, hoping you would guess it. And then in the end, he finally did guess one player. And I'm not going to say who it was because that's a good question for the, another fan trying to earn a follow. Anyway, we did this uh, video review of, uh, regular action figure review of Blizzard Strike Drift. Rob Forky Jr. says it all. Great video, but Drift is a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, I need five minutes. Oh, the figure was terrible. Watch the, watch the review, it was just awful. Hot Rod 271 for the win. Have you seen Skylinks yet? Uh, I have not. Uh, I hear the new Titan series um, are, are hitting stores everywhere. I've been to Target. I've been to Walmart. The Toys R Us here it never has anything. I, I literally, I, I order a lot off of HasbroToyShop.com because, I mean, they're, it's their product and they have it. CJRT says, hi, Alex. Dr. J says, awesome video, Alex. Tyler Dixon says, hey, it's me. And I'm like, hey, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> Alexander Phillips is a big fan. It was his birthday last week. Who remembers? Hope you had a good birthday, Alexander. Last week's fan mail was the Pets movie theme. Pets, the li secret life of pets. It was a big movie. Feisty Pants and I went to go see it. It was hilarious. Uh, Feisty Pants, we did a short video of Feisty Pants has fish. And I'm like, wonder what you guys do all day while I'm gone. They just swim around the tank. Uh, we did a couple of, we did a pair of fan mail shorts. David from Oklahoma sent in some 92 Fleer Ultra and Eric Johnson tweeted me a picture of some Andy Van Slyke cards he found in his binder as he was going through some cards. And I did this whole video about like, oh, you only found one? <laughs> I got like a whole fucking box of them. It was great. Um, check out the fan mail shorts I, uh, I made last week. The, uh, it's called Eric Johnson Fan Mail. E R I C Johnson. You you go back. You find it. Uh, Pokey Pokey Transformer says the new Titans are at Walmart. I've been to Walmart. They ain't there. Rob Forky Jr. says it's Fan Mail Friday. <laughs> yes it is. Yes it is. Bam, bam, bam. That's my new day dance. All right. Uh, David Griffin says awesome fan mail. Paul Willis says excellent as always. J Jake Salcedo says. Do you plan on getting more pets? Yeah, you know, I want to get, like, a bigger tank. You know, the big, gigantic, like, size of the wall tank. And um, I want to throw, like, 100 fish in there. I want to do one end that looks like Dagobah. I want to do I want to do the other end where my fish, white dragon scale, beta fish, <laughs> something, dark side, can still swim around all those castles. Right now we have a small tank, and there's only, like, four fish in there. Five fish. D-Man says, nice video. Shibar says... You are a great YouTuber. Thank you, sir. And uh, Dakota Lowe says, good video. Let's make baseball cards great again. Let's. <laughs> I'm working on it. Let's. Uh, on, the, on the Eric Johnson uh, fan mail short, got a lot of comments. It was a good it was a good video. All about the huge Andy Van Slyke col card collection that I have. Rob Forky Jr. says, I love it. Lots and lots of baseball cards. David Griffin says, holy crap, times 100. That's a whole lot of Andy Van Slyke cards. When did you start collecting them? Back in 1980, end of 1987, really like full on 1988. And then I got, you know, his rookie came up in 84. So I had to backtrack some, some years and some sets. But uh, ultimately 1987, I was just like, hey, this is that guy. Bloodshot says a few. Ha ha ha. Sid from Three Deliveries says, epic fan mail, dude. 
And uh, D-Man says, what? This is all the cards you have? I'm very disappointed. <laughs> D-Man, I love your sense of humor, man. You're the best. Uh, nice collection. I thought you'd have more cards. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. 